today I have for you a stretching and a strengthening exercise combo on the floor. Doesn't everybody love the floor? I have Ellen in with me today and we're going to take you through a range of exercises that is going to stretch the midsection but at the same time strengthen. So are you ready Eleni? So we start off with the Russian twist. Okay Eleni take your arms out 45 degrees, that's perfect. Now take a deep breath in through your nose and breathe out. As you breathe out, I'm gonna take you to each side. You completely relax your knees and your legs and come back in the middle. Take a deep breath in here in the middle and then breathe out. As you breathe out, fully relax and enjoy the stretch. Excellent, and come back in the middle again, breathing in and then breathing out. Just enjoy the stretch after supporting your legs. Awesome, and then come back in the middle. Take a deep breath in here and then breathe out. And I want you to hold it here. So hold it here, deep breath in and breathe out. As you breathe out, I'm gonna allow you to stretch a little bit further. Breathing in again, and then breathe out and stretch it out. Excellent, come back in the middle. We're gonna do the other side. Take a deep breath in, and then breathe out. As you breathe out, fully relax your knees and your legs and into your lower back. Take a deep breath in here, and then breathe out and let it all go. Good, one more time, breathing in, and then breathing out. Awesome, coming back in the middle. Let's finish off with just a few more on each side. So breathing in, going out and you'll find that this is actually stretching your lower back and you can go further and further each time. And again to the other side. We wanna do about 10 of these, okay? So you feel a nice stretch for five on each side. Keep going one more side and stretching out, stretching out. Okay, now we're going to go straight into the leg curl. So take the ball out and place your heels and your calves on top of the ball. Now it's important to have a little bit of gap between so you can stabilize. I want you to lift your hips up and now you've got a nice long bridge and you've got your glutes stabilizing you as well. Bend your knees and bring the ball underneath you. Let's get 12 of these, that's one. Good, that's two. Keep going, Eleni. That's three. So you wanna curl in faster and go out slower. Good, keep going. At six, keep going, and again. Good, keep going. And again. Okay, that's awesome. All right, now going down, and now ball goes away. I want you to lie down on your side and face that way. Okay, so we're going to do the side leg lift. We begin with the top leg being straight, the bottom leg is bent, the body is nice and long and supporting your head on your arm. So Eleni, are you ready? Yes. Draw your belly button in and pelvic floor lift it up as well. You wanna start off with the same height off your hips, so your leg is nice and long, you don't wanna go any higher or you don't wanna go down any, any lower. So coming up, lifting your leg as if I've got a string on your ankle and I'm pulling you up and dropping you down nice and slow. So you wanna do 10 of these with a good contraction in your midsection as well. So going up and going down, your head is nice and relaxed, your whole posture is nice and straight and completely relaxed. So keep going, Eleni, and you wanna feel it right in there. Okay, so you've done your 10. Now you're going to bend the knee here and your legs are positioned perfectly for your next exercise. So coming up, Eleni, on your forearm and we're going to do a side hover. Position your elbow directly under your shoulder there and now just lifting your hips off the floor and maintaining that straight and nice long body. Your arm is coming up nice and straight and just really working through your obliques on that section there. Perfect, okay, so you wanna hold this for about 30 seconds. It's a warm up exercise, it's not a strengthening exercise. And you'll find that you're preparing your body for the next exercises that you're going to do in the day. Keep the arm up. Great, so now let's progress to all fours. So Eleni, come up on your knees and your hands. Perfect, now take your knees apart slightly. You wanna have a curvature into your lower back and you wanna have your hands directly under your shoulders. And keep looking down so that I have curvature in here, which is a natural curvature and a natural curvature in here. Draw your belly button in and stabilize through your shoulders, make sure you relax them. And I want you to do with this leg side leg lift. So go for 10 of them. Good, just maintain your contraction into your pelvic floor and your deep abdominal wall. Great, keep going. So you've done your 10 on that side. Now the last bit of the combination is a full hover. So go down and forward. Good, now draw your belly button in and just drop your hip down forward. Good, now maintain your neck alignment there 
and just keep that nice posture. Don't drop it down too far, it's right there. Good, so just hold it on there and stay there for 30 seconds. So as you finish off your first set, you wanna have a quick break and then come back and repeat the whole set all over again. Make sure you do 10 repetitions on each side. For more health and lifestyle tips, please visit my website on www.marybacon.com.